What is up, guys? Thaddeus here. I'm. It's a bit different, actually. I'm on. This is this is this is on an iPhone 7 Plus. My camera bag is right there, but all my batteries are dead. Uh, and I ordered two more. I ordered two more from Amazon, okay? And like they haven't came. It's been like two weeks. Okay, I, okay, it's been like two days, but like still, what the fuck? Oh, oh, if you guys didn't notice, um, YouTube actually hit me because I swear my videos. Cause like that's that, that's my brand, yo. I can't change that. So they, they started limiting my monetization or something like that. So I was like, I was like taking my ads off. So we'll see how that goes. Cause like I know like YouTube favors videos with ads because you know they make money and shit like that. So we'll see what happens with that. But right now I'm gonna just not take like no ads for you guys, right? Um, which is cool. Which is cool. Cause then you know the video starts sooner. We get to the we get to the juice sooner or to the meat um, and juice, I guess if that's your cup of tea. But 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 uh, what was I talking about? Oh yeah yeah and and, and you know what I like when there's ads running and I'm making. Like okay money off my ads, you know you know what that means. That means there's like some of you guys are buying from these ads about other econ. Like bruh, I got a course buy my shit. What the? F Always plug. Okay, but still there is a PDF in the in the bottom of the studio, which is what this whole video is about essentially, guys. It's just like a whole timeline and structure on how you can go like your first month on Shopify and plan out these these influencer shoutouts. Where to like what to do if shoutouts aren't working, if they are working, when to expand, when to like add more shoutouts, and then when to actually move into sponsored posts, paid ads, um, all that kind of good stuff. That's linked in the description below. The course is also closing soon, guys. Twenty twenty five percent off. I'm adding two more videos to the course tonight as well, and I might actually bump up the price other course just because soon there's gonna be so many videos that like like it'll be worth like 10 times more than what I'm actually charging but there is the discount now I don't know when I'm gonna wrap it up honestly like I, I honestly just when these other projects launch I'm just gonna close the course down and they're launching soon like within the month um, so that's the deal guys hop in the course download the free PDF it's completely free I'm just trying to help you and just you know give me your email <laughs> marketing so I will see you guys and yeah cut back to the actual other part that I recorded right before. in this in this video I want like I'm actually at my old high school right now that I graduated from picking up my little sister I always help the fam guys so I'm literally just like killing time here I figured like I want to make a video because I've been gone for like this video I want to talk to you guys like I someone someone commented and it got a few likes actually so I was like you know I'll make a video on this but uh, do you guys hear that beep do you guys hear the rain too fuck this audio man wish I had my actual camera set. okay so I want to talk about like someone someone commented on my newest video asking you know um, saying something about like you know, how people get attached to their products or to their to their ad campaigns and they don't want to like they don't want to scrap it all because you know they put time and effort into it and they don't want to scrap it they just keep dumping money in expecting to get money out and that's not always the case, right? Like, it's not. You can you can you can have a terrible ad set that you spent hours on. Like, I mean, you usually don't need to spend hours on a particular ad set, but like you can. I mean, especially if you're starting out, right? You want to like your attention to detail. You could end up, you know, spending a few hours on these ad sets that you're working on, and then you just don't get results. They don't convert. You don't know your demographic. Again, guys, that's why in my course, always plug. I go with Instagram influencers first. Literally, I don't have like I don't I don't like guess what my demographic is on Facebook like paid ads or Instagram sponsored posts. I don't guess about that until I've ran with influencers, had that pixel on my site. It's collecting data, it's collecting data, collecting data, collecting for like a month, and then we like look into ads, start scaling like because we have like we've built up leads like leads. Okay, we we know who our clientele are after a month's time. You just gotta be patient, guys. And I know a month is like a lot for you guys that are like that are just starting out. Like you, like you're hype, you want to get going like right away, and it's just patience, guys. Because like you can trip up so easily in dropshipping. Like like one bad ad set. Like say say you have a hundred dollars to spend on ads and and you blow a hundred on this one ad set that you like that you thought would do really well because you you think you know who your you know, your audience is your demographic is and you you don't make any money back or you make like one sale or, like you just don't you don't break even you don't even make like make a profit right that really sucks it really like get, like gets you and a lot of people just dump money in they expect to like oh yeah I can print money um, with with these like paid ads and it's, like you can you can don't get me wrong you can print money once you know your numbers okay like not right away. Again, it's all about patience and experimentation. Like, if if you know it takes like say five dollars um, to get someone to buy a twenty dollar product on your site or something like that, right? And your cost of goods is only like eight, you're in the green, right? You're in the green. That's how you print money, okay? But you don't know it takes you five dollars. You don't know that until you've experimented with different ad sets, with different like ad copy words, images, like especially with paid ads, like your your audiences and expanding with that. But you don't know what those numbers are until you've experimented, until you've tried, until you've scrapped like multiple multiple ad sets until you find one that like does like performs like very very well for the audience that it's in and then after that gets saturated you know you got to like expand and read like redo it and retouch it and all that stuff but again with paid ads there's a different story with instagram ads and shoutouts and stuff like that you don't need to like worry too much about what your audience is you find a page that has your audience like already in it like the, like people follow those pages for a reason right with facebook ads you can like you can target those people you can guess but when you're running shoutouts the people that are interested like they automatically go to your um, to your site, right? And the thing with like influencers these days, like guys, in, in a year and a half, it's gonna be a whole different story, okay? But now, 
influencers don't realize how much their 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 network or their audiences are worth, right? They're they're selling shoutouts like so much cheaper than what they could be, but because everyone else is like selling them dirt cheap too, they have to sell dirt cheap too, right? Because it's like like your competitors, right? So you see some people selling shoutouts for five hundred dollars, some people selling out for like a hundred dollars, but they have like similar followings, right? One, they might know the actual value of their audience. The other guy might not, or one's just a shitty page and stuff like that. Like that's why it's like a very confusing time for this whole influencer space but it's very good for like for people like us that are trying to break through and like get a, a good quality site and like explode like our revenue right and like blow up on drop shipping that allows us to like move into different opportunities and whatnot but because of that guys because of that influencers don't realize the value of their like of the of the audience and you can capitalize off that by getting like cheaper shout outs so your money you get more bang for your buck by purchasing shout outs before you go into paid ads okay at least at least on like my perspective of it i'm sure like if you know what you're doing with paid ads then you could probably you know like do better with that than shout outs okay uh, it's just it's just like whatever you're better at. and i like this is why i teach you guys my way because i know like what i do works and i can like i I'm, I'm in the green on everything i do so that's what i'm that's what i'm like talking to you guys about um literally there in the link below in the link below in the link below there is a pdf okay that's gonna have this little checklist and basically it's gonna run you through like all right when you start with influencer shout outs okay what are you gonna do you're gonna like test with like what two two different influencers two different shout outs different ad copies different pictures stuff like this and it has like a whole a whole like layout like grid sort of aspect to it so that you can have something tangible to look at and plan out like all right this is how i want to test it this is how i want to go after a month's time you know, I can go and start with like experiment with like sponsored posts, paid ads and stuff like that. But I wouldn't like worry about that now until you guys are seeing some sort of results with your influencers. Like once you start getting like a little bit in the green with influencers, then you know that your, your data is like, you, you know, you know who you're, who's buying and you just find more people like that with paid ads. Okay. So that's, that's what you do with 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 like this strategy right and this guide is gonna show you guys this whole month plan okay so like say you're starting off what do you do in like day one day two day three pre-launch okay like how are you gonna like plan out these strat like these shout outs and strategize them so you can like make sure that okay this audience is coming from this guy this audience is coming from this guy this traffic is coming from here 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 and plan that all out and that's what the PDF is guys I'm testing things out like I don't think I, there's no reason to charge for it honestly but if you are in my course you get a plug too with a bigger PDF so I mean just saying just saying guys the course is closing soon 25 percent off in the link in the description um also by the way i am adding two more videos to the course tonight um which is kind of like honestly i might even increase the price of the course just because like some people are buying in i keep adding like videos like for free and and like eventually there's gonna be like way more videos than like anyone else on, on the fucking youtube right and i might need to charge more I, i'm just saying marketing guys marketing scarcity and urgency guys it is closing soon though 25 percent off the link in the description and uh, yeah, download the PDF too, cause like, why not? Like, that's just gonna help you. But that is the video, guys. I just want to talk about influencers and paid ads, and like, like what, like what I do, and like where you can go from it, depending on where you're, like, what stage you're at, and whatnot. And like, um, I get a lot of people like just like they haven't started their Shopify store yet, guys. If you haven't started your Shopify store, there's link, like, there's links everywhere, honestly, everywhere. But don't actually start until you've like plan shit out right like i have a shopify launch checklist i have everything i have a course and that's the video guys i don't want to plug too hard but i will see you in the next one i actually have like a bunch of videos planned out for these next few days so stay tuned leave a like comment subscribe i respond to everyone's comments you know the deal and i will see you guys in the next video i don't think i'm leaving anything out just check out the pdf that's literally what this video is about just pdf 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 um Hope you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe, leave a co or I, oh my god, uh, like, comment, subscribe. I respond to all you guys' comments. Um, if you guys like, leave video ideas too. If you guys want to see, like, I get inspiration from you guys' comments to like figure out what my like what you guys need help with, right? That's like the best feedback I can get. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. I actually got a surprise for some of you guys because some of you guys have been asking for like private mentorship or like one on ones or like small exclusive groups. I got, I got something cooking, okay? So I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video talking about that. Have a good day, guys. I'm back from the dead from five days, and I'm still kind of sick, though. Like, what the fuck? All right, see you guys later. Peace. One last thing, or, yeah, one last thing, you guys. I totally forgot to say this, but I actually found a really good way um, to, like, respond to you guys' questions. Like, there is email support in the Facebook group for the course. Always plug, but, but, but I mean, I did a few hard plugs in this video, but... But, but, but what I'm saying, follow me on Twitter. I'm underscore Thaddeus, all right? I'll link it, like, right, or, like, right here. It'll be in the link in the description, too. Follow me on Twitter and just shoot me tweets, literally. And I'll respond to them, and, like, it'll help everyone because they can view questions and stuff, too. And I think that'll be, like, a really good, like, community sort of, like, thing to, like, build around where I can just answer everyone's questions on public tweets so everyone can see, everyone can learn, and everyone can, like, experience that. Um, 
If I mean, of course, if you do have more like bigger, bigger questions, you can hit me up on my email or DM me on Instagram. I try, like, I, I try to respond to everyone, but like, I'm just fucking swamped. I have to give priority to the people in the course and the Facebook group because you know they 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 fronted money for that. Um, but that's that. That's the. All right, I just want to plug my Twitter. Let's plug my Twitter guy or follow me on Instagram too, because you know I'm trying to trying to get 10k followers, which I'm actually coming up on. Ooh. Okay. That's the that's the that's the thing, guys. Follow me on Twitter. Ask me questions there too. Uh, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Yeah. Peace.